Hey, what's up, YouTube? And today I am back with another video after eight months. I am really not active on this channel because I have an actual channel that I upload on. It's not this one. This channel is, I just give tutorials on it and shit. But, you know, I, bank, I went back on this channel and seen that how to allow my on Discord on the Chromebook has 3.4k views at the moment i'm kind of astonished because i didn't think it was going to get that much views this is giving some more views than my other channel to you to be honest with you and i really see potential in this channel so i would really start uploading on this video and by the way i have i got a pc from now on i won't be on chromebook as much unless i'm giving out tutorials on how to do stuff on a chromebook and yeah i'll be dedicated to this channel more by the way and yeah shit i find and the reason why i'm making this video another how-to tutorial is because people still have been commenting on the video that i made from last year oh can you give us another loud mic tutorial oh band lab doesn't work no more they patched it they got rid of pause effects can you make another tutorial i am willing to do just that and helping y'all out because i am a nice guy and we're gonna get started and right now so first what you want to do is you want to copy this link right here which i'm going to put in the description down below all these three links right here i am going to put in the description down below so this is the link to uh to uh go on flat flat flats pack and they take you to the link will take you to this website right here and what you want to do is follow the steps right here so number one says enable linux support so what you want to do what is basically telling you to do is you have to go to settings you can go on to develop you have to go on to developers developers it will say linux the de 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 development environment i am pretty sh i am pro I'm, I'm sure that it will give you an option to let you download it. It doesn't matter what you put the disk size as. It could be recommended, which is at 10 gigabytes. I just keep it as I just to keep it as that. Also, you want to turn this this um this thing on. Allow Linux Linux to access your microphone. So you want to turn this on. But of course, if I do it, it's going to end the video. So I am not going to do it. I'm gonna click out of it. But y'all do it though. All right, once your Linux is done, you want to open up terminal, right? You want to open this up. And I will give y'all a demonstration on how to do this because I I'm pretty sure some of y'all don't like know how to use keys and shit, but yeah. So, once you download Linux and you want to open up your terminator, I mean, terminal, which is this. You want to open it. You want to click penguin it'll take you to this so what I do is I am going to um, you want to scroll down you want to copy two of the you want to copy these two these two right here you want to copy this copy it from this this part which I'm going to put the link in the description down below for this link so you want to copy this and I'm gonna give you a prime example okay so you copy this right all right, we're on the terminal. You want to press Control Shift V, and it will come up like this. And then you want to press Enter. Since I already have it, it's gonna make it look shorter for me. But I gave y'all a demonstration. So when you click, when y'all, when you um try to click the link and paste it onto here, you want to press Control Shift V to enter, and you'll do that for the second one as well. But since I already have it and it's like this, I don't really need to do it. So you want to click out of that once you're done. But wait for it to wait until it's done downloading, which will probably take like about a minute to three minutes. And yeah, after that's downloaded, you want to download, you want to type in Discord Linux, Discord Linux. You want to click this link, it will automatically download and then you will go to your files. Files right here make sure you check this there you know but yeah once you do the terminal once you do the terminal linux download thing you should have an app called easy effects which is at the bottom right here on my tabs it's at the bottom so with that being said that should be done downloading and you want to make sure you're um 
your input is at 36 to the maximum you know what I mean because why not I did not mean to turn that on you want to put this at you want to type hold on you want to put this as 0, 0, 0 0.0 dB you want to put this at 0 0.01 ms oops wrong button also for the second one too 1 You want to put this at 36B. Oh, I could just type this shit in. These are my sets. They're probably not the greatest because, you know, I don't allow mic no more. But if y'all want to find some good sets, you can find it off somebody else's channel. And yeah, I don't have my mic, so it's not going to be as loud. Oh, I didn't even see this. Yeah, keep this at zero. Oops, I did not mean to mess it up, but yeah, you want to keep this at zero or something like that. Make sure you put this at 36 though. Make it at the maximum. And it should be something like and it should be something like this, but I don't have my microphone right now. And yeah. Make sure y'all like, subscribe to the video. Peace. I will be uploading on this channel more on my PC.